Hey Zany fam, we're doing this owl build today. The booklet is 160 pages and we are currently on page 45. We just finished the bottom, so this is like the perch where the owl is gonna sit on. Check out the cool brick separator it comes with. It's got this tip that's perfect for Technic pins. It pinches them out. No more having to look for random tools to get them out. So perfect. So we decided to collect all our brick separators that we've collected over the years and kind of just show you guys. We'd love to know which is your favorite one to use. So far, this one's definitely winning the race for us. We even have a black one. Not all these are Lego. Some of these came with other sets like this one. This company happens to have some of the coolest builds. We actually built their um, Beetle car, right? The Beetle yeah. balloon car. And now we're building this one. We still have section two, three, and four to go, but we'll show you what it looks like when we're all done. It's gonna be pretty cool. Only 120 pages left to go. Zany fam, if you're thinking about doing this build, but you're worried because you think it's gonna be super hard, let me tell you what, even though this is over 1,100 pieces, I feel like we're moving through this pretty quickly because the guide is so well made. Like, do you guys see how they have the arrows pointed and they have the pieces highlighted? It really gives you <laughs> a very, very... I lost my train of thought. The guidebook, the instruction manual is really clear, like the arrows and the highlighted studs and everything. It's just super easy to follow. So I thought like it would take a, I don't know, maybe four days. I thought each section would take like a day because we're obviously not building 24 hours a day. But no, because I'm a speed runner. Okay. No, it really like I built a lot of this and I thought that because there's so many small studs that I was going to be there putting studs on here forever. Like, see how he's doing this kind of intricate build? But it's not. We're almost done. This is the rest of Section 3, and those are the bags for 4, and we're almost done with this build. So it really makes a difference when these books are done right. I'm happy with this. I can't wait to see what this owl looks like. Loving it. Happy dance. Happy dance. <laughs> Look at how we're adding that second eye on. The first eye's in place. It's so pretty. Oh, how satisfying to hear that click. It's so colorful. We're not done yet, but you can see the owl now. How amazing. I can't wait to keep this on display. It's going to really bring joy like every day. We can put it next to our lovebirds. So pretty. Look at the back real quick. Okay, hey, we're not done yet. We're gonna keep building. Look, we still have a bunch of pieces down here. Ooh, exciting. Building mode. This has definitely been one of our favorite builds to date. 1,193 pieces have come together to form this owl. What the owl looks like all done from the flowers at the bottom and the vines to his claws right here, all of the flowers on the body, around the eyes, and even on the crown. 360 degrees of just the most beautiful details. The wings have so much detail. And take a look at the back. There's like a little uh, balancing square or balancing rectangle piece right here so that you can put this and not have to worry about the weight swinging back or anything like that. It also has a little bit of give so that you don't need to worry about like moving it around and it totally falling apart. This has definitely been one of our favorite builds. Let us know if you like it and if you want to pick it up. This is what it looks like. Thanks for watching.